What's up guys? It's your boy DJ Soul Force. Uh, this is a couple of days after Hurricane Dorian guys and it's always a nice beautiful pretty day the next couple of days after a major storm. I'm surveying the damage out here I just pulled up to uh, our favorite test site. <laughs> you can see people in the swimming pool over there. There's one down tree right there. We're gonna go and try to get us a test flight in of the Holy Stone HS-161. But just as I was pulling in and uh, setting up under the pavilion, I noticed some of the ceiling gone. <laughs> wow. So there are signs that a storm did come through here. I took some of my stuff out of the car already and noticed some of the ceiling tiles were missing and I see them laying out here in the field. <laughs> wow. Guys, uh, also today's wind was only expected to be about two or three miles per hour, but we got a little bit more than that out here today. So I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get a flight in with this girl today or not, but real quick, let's go ahead and open the box. Let's kill that music before uh, YouTube get me for copyright. And let's take a quick look at uh, the HS-161, guys. Now, before we get into this re review, uh, I, I have to give it to Holy Stone once again. Two thumbs up for finally <laughs> coming out with something different than what everybody else is producing. This is the HS-161, guys. It's a foldable drone that's... Uh, when folded, uh, you can actually put this in your pocket. Uh, the drone has the battery in it already. Okay, let's unfold it. Take a quick look at it. <laughs> it's a uh, brush motor selfie drone, guys. Uh, however, this one's clocking a 1080p camera. Uh, it's got a super, super intense and bright headlight there that can also be used as a flashlight. <laughs> That's right, you can fire up the uh, headlight without turning the drone on and uh, without using a remote controller. There you can see the independent off and on switch for the headlight. Guys, while folded, you can also turn on and access the 1080p camera without using a remote controller. And uh, that's pretty cool. So this little drone, claims to do a bit of everything it's a uh, <laughs> it's a handheld uh, uh, camera you can take still photos I believe yes there's a video button and a camera button right there This drone also has a USB port that can be used to take power from the drone's battery and uh, give your smartphone a boost in power if needed. Uh, I'm not sure how practical that is guys but uh, it's just a nice feature to have to know that uh, if your battery in the drone has power and your phone has run out of power this little drone could perhaps save your life. <laughs> Guys, uh, as soon as the wind dies down a little bit, we're going to give it a flight here. Uh, if I can't get a flight in here, uh, we'll take it back home and fly it in my front yard. But uh, the, the bird also has optical flow sensor, uh, altitude hold. Uh, it's not GPS, but from some of the uh, previous reviews I've seen, it's got a damn good optical flow sensor on it. This thing is steady as a rock. So there's our quick sneak peek guys at the Holy Stone HS-161. If I can finish this review today, if not, uh, I'll be releasing this video as a sneak peek video. It's your boy DJ Soul Force. I'm out of here.